congratulations, you're promoted. And I'm like, good morning. Are you awake? <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be talking to you guys about life of a pharmacy tech. Also, if I got a promotion, what it's like, my new uniform, all that stuff. So if you want to see that, just keep on watching. So as many of you know, I am currently a public employee. I've been in the company for like three years now. I do a lot of videos on how to get hired, what to expect, all that good stuff. So if you want to check that out, if you want to get hired, if you want to make money, sh money, get the bag, make sure you go ahead and check out those videos. In today's video, I'm going to be talking to you guys a little bit about what it's like to be a pharmacy tech, things and tricks to get hired. I did another video similar like this with another pharmacy tech. I kind of did like a little collab with her. Me and her don't work at the same Publix or in the same pharmacy, but we're both pharmacy techs and obviously every Publix kind of like asked for the same things. So that's how we did a little collab and we kind of shared our experience and she shared her experience on how she got hired because my experience obviously was a little different. So if you want to see those, make sure you check it out. So considering my experience was a little different, I was like, let me hop on the camera and tell you guys about my personal like situation, story, stuff like that while I got ready with you guys. So I just got back from school. I do school in the mornings full time and then I work in the afternoons full time. So I'm getting ready now for my shift, but my makeup is kind of done. Um, I didn't really do the makeup on the camera because y'all know like my everyday makeup look. I feel like I do it in all, all my videos, but I mean, if you guys want to see it, I have no problem doing it um more often with you guys but basically i just did my lashes i did a little bit of lip gloss um i put a little bit of glitter and picked up my hair nothing crazy i have to change and i want to get my nails done before i get into work so i'm gonna obviously show you guys all that with me now i quickly want to like talk about the promotion aspect of it because originally like i said i've been working in the company for three years i was working in the customer service department i was a customer service associate so i would deal with like returns lottery um you know cigarettes stuff like that when the whole pandemic started obviously pharmacy was backed up they didn't have enough employees to take care of all the customers that were coming because there was hundreds of thousands of people coming you know to get the vaccines and stuff like that so a lot of times when anything similar like this happens you know in any department even in the deli department sometimes you know when the super bowl is coming and stuff like that the department gets very backed up and they need immediate help right away so they don't really have time to wait for someone to get hired they need help right away so they pull people from different departments which is kind of like what happened with me now i did have a little bit of experience in the medical field because i used to work in a medical office but it's very different because in the medical office i dealt with insurances and sending kind of like the request for a refill to the pharmacy and the pharmacy deals with the second hand aspect which is actually filling that request so i never really dealt with the things that i deal with pharmacy but i did have some kind of medical background in a sense i was not happy at that job in the medical field not because of the actual job task but it was about the people i was surrounded with i feel like they didn't really care much about their patients and i'm such like a compassionate person and i feel for everyone so it just wasn't the right work environment for me so i ended up leaving and i am no longer there and i was always still at Publix. i never left Publix despite whatever jobs i did on the side but the pharmacy manager asked if he could borrow me for a few days in the pharmacy i realized that i really liked it and he realized that i worked very well so i kind of just started working more shifts there to the point where i don't ever have any more shifts in the customer service department so i think they're about to switch me now to pharmacy tech full-time not full-time i'm sorry but like basically that just be the title of my position i would be considered a pharmacy tech like a registered tech um i don't work full-time at public so it wouldn't be full-time but it would be full-time in the sense of like any any of my shifts would basically just be in the pharmacy because that's the department that i would belong to now when i first switched into pharmacy a lot of people were congratulating me like oh you know congrats that's a promotion that's this that's more money da, da, da. so i wanted to clear that up because everyone was like congratulations you're promoted and i'm like this ain't really a promotion y'all like <laughs> it's like switching departments kind of so i just wanted to clarify i ended up yes i now work in the um, Publix pharmacy, but my pay didn't really change because I was already making um, more than the minimum that pharmacy makes and I feel like all the girls in customer service are making more than the minimum that pharmacy makes. Now, is there more room for improvement to end up making more long term? Yes, but you know, there wasn't like an immediate raise or anything. Number one. Number two, like I said, it was just kind of like a switch in department. So I guess because there is room for improvement and because people probably thought that i was trying to study to become a pharmacist which is now what i am trying to study but at the beginning i wasn't people were congratulating me because they were like oh like you're off to bigger and better things rather than just working customer service but customer service department is still a really good department to be in and i still have occasionally 
some shifts that are in customer service but um from now on i think they're all going to be in pharmacy but i have no problem with you know working a shift in customer service because that's the department that i really know inside and out so pharmacy i'm still fairly new to it now finally after working in the pharmacy for quite some time they finally gave me my shirt it's right here so it's basically like a zip up jacket i'm gonna show you guys how it looks and i have to wear like a white button up undershirt i think i'm just gonna wear a long sleeve though because i don't have a white button up um long shirt oh wait i actually do from my cashier uniform but i don't know if that fits i don't know so yeah i'm gonna try this on for you guys and show you but i just wanted to clear that up because so many people were like oh is it a promotion is it this I mean, I guess it's kind of like a more specific area. Like, a, I belong to a more um, defined department. You know, it's like smaller and more professional in a sense, more serious, a lot more busier. But it's still, you know, another department and I'm still making the same money. But um, I'm not complaining about the money. I was making good money in customer service, but, you know. So I just want to really clear that up, but I do think that I will eventually get promoted because I do think I'm a good pharmacy tech and then eventually I would like to become obviously a pharmacist because I feel like this is what I'm really good at and no, it wasn't always like a definite decision that that's what I wanted to do, but after working in the pharmacy, I realized that I, I really do like it. I enjoy it. So I'm actually right now taking prereqs, um, like this morning I took a prerequisite to eventually end up getting into pharmacy school and studying that so i just wanted to give like you know the full scoop before i start showing you guys stuff but yeah so this is how the actual uniform looks i got a size medium this is how it looks it just has like little Publix pharmacy um sign there so i'm just gonna go ahead and change and then show you guys it's completely like zip up so i have to unzip it and then after I get changed, we're going to go ahead and do our nails. Your pants still have to be all black. Same thing if you wear customer service or any um, position, basically. I mean, if you wear customer service, you can you can wear khakis now. But um, I usually just wear all black. Most of my um, friends all wear black pants as well. And then your shoes always have to be all black also. So the only thing that really changes is your top. Oh, and by the way, when I do work in pharmacy, I feel like this is just in any department, but especially me with pharmacy since I have to be looking down a lot counting um each and every pill I like to keep my hair out of my face even this which is half up half down when I'm looking down it comes in my face and it can get a little annoying because I'm counting all these pills so sometimes I'll pick my hair back completely because you got to sit there with the spatula counting which I'll show you guys how it goes but it's not very um useful to have your hair like all up in your face like that i'm one of the few girls in my store who works in pharmacy there's like maybe one other girl who works in the pharmacy but i'm sure in different stores there's a lot more girls so i'm just giving a little heads up my girls out here it's gonna be difficult because you're literally looking down in customer service you're looking like left right yeah you're talking you gotta you're not doing that in pharmacy in pharmacy you're not talking as much you're just counting pills and putting pills away and dealing with vaccines and you know you don't want to have that in your face also um i like to put my lashes i don't feel like it affects me do whatever makeup is good for you you know i like to still wear a mask because people sometimes come to the pharmacy who might be a little sick and with the pandemic still going on you don't want to risk anything so i still wear my mask and i like to do like a light face makeup so like i said i already kind of like did my makeup i might touch it up right before i go into work but for the most part this is how i'm looking so let's change all right guys so this is basically how it looks i put a white sleeve um undershirt i kind of had like this pink crowd top under which um serves as kind of like a bra but i know that they were like a white undershirt so i put the white undershirt and then this is how it looks here it has the Publix pharmacy logo right there and then that's how it looks so i'm very excited that's how it looks from the back none crazy i feel like i low key look like a nurse so but I'm very excited because it is my first day in this official uniform and I'm very happy because this is kind of like my field of study so it feels good to work in something that's my field of study. And a fun fact is actually I need a lab coat tomorrow for one of my chemistry classes but they told me I can literally just wear this so I don't have to go out and buy a lab coat so they came in clutch because now I can just wear this and I don't have to you know wear my lab coat i just hope i don't dirty this because i don't want to go with a dirty uniform but yeah so anyways it has a little pocket here for like a pen or a notepad or something and then two pockets down um here like like a normal nurse wear and yeah so i'm gonna go ahead oh excuse me i'm gonna go ahead and start doing my nails so i'm gonna show you guys these are the nails right here 
I got them at Walmart. They're the press-on nails because ain't nobody got time to do acrylics right now. So <laughs> I'm just going to put these press-on nails on. Super cute, super um, humble and like not humble, but like super classy in my opinion. So let's go ahead and glue them on and I'll show you guys. All right, so I just finished doing the press-ons. I don't know if you guys can really tell, but oh, look, there's my doggy. It's kind of like a white, like a cream white and some glitter. And I put a ring and, you know, my bracelet and stuff. I think it looks really nice, so I'm just going to go ahead and get going because it's almost time for my shift to start. Like always though, my must-haves, my lip gloss. I am going to be wearing my mask, but y'all know I love my lip gloss. And then... So I think we are ready to go. Um, I just got some a really weird comment on YouTube. That's the thing with um, public comments. You get weird comments. But yeah, these are my nails. I don't know if you guys can really see. But yeah, these are my nails. I love them. Cream white. Um, I'm also wearing white. And then the ring, I feel like it just looks classy. I feel like the whole look looks classy. Um, I finished putting on my lip gloss. Must go or must have um, lip gloss and lipstick. It's like my go-to. And yeah, so I'm ready to go be a pharmacy tech. So I'm going to take you guys with me, but I can't record inside the store. So other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, if you guys could please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in my next video. I also ordered some like pills and a pill counter so I can show you guys kind of like what I do at work at home. So if you guys want to see that, just go ahead and let me know and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. All right, so I just got here. I'm getting my gum. <gasps> my nail popped off. <laughs> this glue that I use is so ratchet. My nails are going to be popping off all day. I can feel it. Whatever. So, I'm about to go in now, guys. I'm about to go in now. I low-key haven't worked in a minute, so but I'm about to go in and stuff in my new uniform. And I'm so excited. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm going to go ahead and end it because, like I said, I can't be recording inside the store but if you guys like this video please make sure to like comment and subscribe we're on the road to 2k and i will be showing you guys more of my pharmacy tech experience so if you want to see that make sure you stay in tune Publix pharmacy yeah <laughs> so yeah um other than that i'll see you guys in my next video thanks so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe bye